Hey guys, hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nassine. I do mostly keto vlogs, keto hauls, reviews, meal preps, all that. But I also do a little sprinkle of other things and that's what today's video is gonna be. So this is gonna be for Vlogmas and I'm going to put a full face of makeup on without looking while my roommate records it. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right. So now that Josh has finally steadied the camera, I'm going to be using the Conspiracy palette. I love this palette. This is uh, Shane Dawson and Jeffree Stars. And I'm gonna use some colors that I don't normally use. So first thing is first, I don't have a primer so I will not be priming my face. But I'm just gonna just go in how I normally do my makeup routine, which is by taking this Maybelline Fit Me foundation giving it a little shake and just putting a tiny bit onto my beauty blender. And then dabbing it into places on my face. Is it close enough? Mm -hmm. And then I'm just gonna dab everything all over until it's all, until it's all smoothed out. There's some spots on my face that I've neglected. And you always want to bring it down to your neck. <laughs> All right, I think that feels about right. Feels it looks good. fine. Feels nice. Okay. Now my next step would be to take my Kat Von D shade and light palette and uh, go in with my little... No mirrors. True, I didn't even look. <laughs> um, I'm going to take this shade here I'll just, I'll just use it like this. <laughs> now this is the hard part because to contour, you need to like go onto this. So <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be <laughs> feel for your cheekbones here. This is gonna be so hideous. You don't have anything on. Nothing? Mm -mm. Maybe just a teeny bit. The other side you had some more on. There you go. <laughs> I feel like I went way too far on that. That one's really dark. <laughs> <laughs> and then I need some up here. And then I do some here. And then I take my beauty blender on the other side and I blend that to filth. This is gonna be horrible, I can already tell. I'm gonna go ahead and close that as to not be tempted. It was creating this weird, um, on this, the thing, the reflection. You always want to like blend upwards when you're blend, when you're contouring so you don't like pull your cheekbones down. Josh is learning about makeup today. You're laughing, that means something looks bad. <laughs> this side's super dark compared to the other side. It looks like you got a bruise. <laughs> what? It's so dark. Usually I can see stuff on my beauty blender. I don't even see anything on it. So it's like, is it not as dark as what I thought it was? The next step is concealer. And this is almost something I have to do another one But I like to go under the eye. <laughs> it's such a color difference. A little there. I like to like go under the contour. Did I already put it on my chin? Okay. That's almost gone. And then just buff it like Jimmy. I always pronounce his name as Buffet. Uh, it'll be Corey and Tiffany. Where else did I put this? Up here? And then under my eyes. Okay. Uh, my next step would be to take my, this is just from Ulta Beauty, it's my um, setting powder palette and I like to take the luminous and then just go over like where I put my concealer. Here they are. And then I take my bronzer with a big fluffy brush and go over where I contoured. Then I take blush and you want to go like on uh, the apples of your cheeks. What? What's an apple of your cheek? It's like the round of your cheek. And I like to bring it like up towards my temple. 
<laughs> looks like blush. Looks like you're blushing. Great. It's probably really dark then. So if you think it's too dark, you can kind of go over it with your beauty blender to like dampen it out. It's weird to like look at Josh and like, <laughs> am I doing it right? Okay. <laughs> So and I did, have no clue. We did that. So now my face is done. Now as where I would normally take, this is gonna be great, my eyebrow, my dip pomade with, from Anastasia. First I will brush the brow. This is gonna be where it starts to get a little crazy. So... <laughs> I can see. He's like laughing at me. <laughs> and then you just brush it out. Okay, so next I will take my Conspiracy Theory palette and I'm gonna take um, Tanacon. I always, I'm gonna have to leave that down because it's got a mirror. So I always take Tanacon into my crease with a big fluffy brush. <laughs> it covered it. <laughs> And I have like big, I've got like a lot of space on my eyelid. So I take it far up. Then I take a fluffy crease brush. These are Morphe brushes by the way. And I'm gonna take a uh, Diet Root Beer, which is just like a little darker and put it in the outer V. You're not gonna use cheese dust? Sure, I'll use cheese dust. It doesn't look like you've ever used it. I've never used it. It really looks like cheese dust from like those crunchy things. I don't wanna say anything because they're not a sponsor, but. <laughs> you can say Cheetos. <laughs> Cheesy poofs. <laughs> All right, if we're using cheese dust, let me think. Okay, mm, should I cheese dust? We will do cheese dust in the outer. Oh, <laughs> that's nice. <laughs> oh, that's nice. <laughs> Next, we are going to take a flat shader brush, a flat brush. Come on now. How do you wash your brushes and what do you use? Uh, it's upstairs, but it's just like a brush cleaner. Or you could use like a mild soap, but I have an actual brush cleaner. Would alcohol work? No. I just don't want to get this brush that I use every day and I need to clean it anyways, but I don't want to get it bright red. Whatever. Okay. Then we're going to take Flaming Hot. Oh, like Flaming Hot Cheetos. And you're just going to pat it onto your lid. That works well with cheese dust. I assumed it would. It really looks like the dust from the Flaming Hot on your finger. I really hope like a package doesn't come and I have to like sign for it. <laughs> After your makeup sign and he's like, what? The recording stopped. We have we're back. Hopefully better than ever. All right. All right. So then I'm going to take more cheese dust on a different brush and I'm just kind of like going to go around make sure that it's blended and like take it down. Uh, okay. This is where it's going to get fun. We're going in with some liquid liner. Hmm. I don't know how people can do this. It yes, would freak me out getting it that close, eye. getting that close to my eye and everything. I can never. Oh, Adam Lambert can pull it off, but I don't know how he does it. <laughs> that looks really cool. You're just gonna do the top one. I only want to do the top one. Should I try a wing? What's a wing? Like, like, like winged out. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Your face. We'll try a little wing. And the last step. The way your eyes look when you do that, it's like. I don't have a setting spray. So this is, oh, we need lips. We need a lip. We need a good liquid lip. I don't have anything that's gonna match red and orange. So we're just gonna put on this. This so, is hard to put on. Because your eyes look pink. They don't look red or orange. Really? <laughs> I know I went over there. Try to even that out. I feel like Miranda sings. 
You look like you could go for RuPaul's Drag Race. Mmm, my lips are crusty. Like dry skin. Oh god, that was horrible. I will say, Josh has a really good, um, like, poker face. He's only made a couple of faces, but I could look, probably look like a flaming freak, and he would be like, it looks good! I'm trying to get this dust off of this brush. Okay, so this is the finished loop. I'm terrified. Uh, let's get my family's reaction before I see it myself. Tiffany! Recent Hayen! Nobody wants to look. Corey, come here and look at your mother. Please. She did it blindly. I put on makeup without a mirror. How do I look? Is it good? I did my makeup without a mirror. How do I look? How do I look? What? I did my makeup without a mirror. How do I look? I don't know. Is it good? He's a typical boy. <laughs> Where's Tiffany? I did my makeup without a mirror. How do I look? So uh, did I do a good job? I mean like... Your blush? Not blend very well. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what she looks every day you're saying? No, I mean, no these, are, these are not even. Like, <laughs> well don't fix it, I just... Um, no lipstick? <laughs> And the eyebrows, that's what I was laughing at. Look at the right one compared to the left. Oh yeah. <laughs> your skin. <laughs> what do you mean your skin? My skin? Yeah, usually you like blend it way better. You can see all the flaws. <laughs> Alright, well I'm going to look now. Uh, wow, okay. Uh... Really, I think that the eyeliner is not as bad as what I thought it was going to be. I thought that the eyeliner was going to be like blotchies, places everywhere. Really? And the eyeshadow, to be honest, is not that bad. I was just saying like the colors. And I guess the contour isn't that bad either. I thought the right side was a little darker. The eyebrows... Not the best, but really not terrible. And the lips, the lips, I, I went way over here. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Could have been much worse. <laughs> wow. Oh. Nice. All right, guys. Uh, so that is doing my makeup without any mirrors. I did a lot better than what I thought. Join us next time when I do something else weird. <laughs> Have a good one guys.